Like I tell people, it's like the Star Wars movies. It's like, you know, let the force be with you. So. What's good, man? It's G Christ, man. You chilling with the 5 4 reality show, man. We out here. The light is bright. But we here with the boy Damn Funk. What's up, y'all? Dame Funk saying what's up to y'all. Thanks for having me. And I'm um, up here in Austin, Texas, just doing it. So it is Dame Funk. Because everybody been saying damn fuck, and I'm like, damn. But what I want to say is, we saw you up there, man, keeping it hot, doing the thing. Everybody was dancing, man. We saw, we see the styles. I could definitely hear the West Coast style in there. So, I mean, what uh, what, 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 what kind of things do you put into your style, man, to get your style when you're spinning records and doing your thing, performing? Well, I just remember uh, the funk that I grew up on, like groups like Slave and One Way and m 2 May and P-Funk and Zap and Prince and you know I just mix it all in but still progress it you know what I mean so that's what I'm doing and um it's uh, a privilege to be well it's an uh it's appreciated to be at a festival such as this because it has like a lot of indie rock and a lot of different styles and so it seems that I'm trying to open up the door for modern funk to get into some other areas as opposed to just like R&B radio, you know what I'm saying? They, they play the same 10 artists every day and I'm not trying to be a part of that. I see, I see, man. Earlier I was talking to you about South By. He said he did 14 shows at South By, y'all. 14 shows. Now being a cat in the game that's doing that many shows, man, and just running around and just, you gotta have that same energy each time, man. Where do you find that at, man? I just find it up there, you know what I'm saying? It's like, I just uh, don't think about it too much. I just, like I tell people, it's like the Star Wars movies. It's like, you know, let the force be with you. So if you think about it too much, that's when it gets complicated. So I just go out there, I'm quiet before I go on stage. And when I go on stage, I just let it go for the people. You know what I'm saying? Because they deserve a good show. They pay money. They deserve to have a cat walking around and doing things and playing instruments. and you know, Or, you know, if they DJ and just give it some guts you know what i'm saying and that's what i try to bring every time i'm on stage guts and uh and it's for the people so what's next for dame funk or what do you have now that you want to push to the people like where can they get at you at currently i have an album out called to each his own y'all it's just album i had out in 2009 on stone's throw it's a five record box set it's a unique packaging it comes in five records and um also a double cd and um that's my first album on stone's throw i've been in the game for 20 years it's my first album even coming out with so I've been working hard. I'm not just some overnight dude that you might be hearing about on the internet. I've been doing this for a long time, playing keyboards, you know, 8, Ice Cube, Mag 10, all those cats. So I just finally broke out and started doing this funk. And now we got Adolescent Funk out. It's a project that Peanut Butter Wolf put together that is um, all older material from like 88 to 92 that I had like laying around in shoe boxes and on cassette tapes. So that's like an intermission project and then 2011 will be a, a new album and I haven't titled it yet. So it'll be more refined and not so much music the next one. <laughs> And that's what I'm talking about, man. We here with Dame Funk, not Damn Funk, Dame Funk. You know what I'm saying? Here on the 54 realityshowcom You got to keep your mind.